My name is Michelle Williams. I'm from Atchley, Oklahoma, and I am Braden's mom. I ran off the road a little ways, and uh, this, there's no shoulder, and the road just dropped straight off, and I had a hard time getting back on the road. And when I tried to get back on, I just overcorrected and rolled it. I don't really know much after that. Pretty foggy after that. They said it rolled five times, something like that. Then I got ejected out of the door. Pretty crazy. <clears throat> the two white top posts through there about a 45 degree with this fence and I found him out yonder, about 30 yards from that barbed bar fence on his side. This way. Headed home. As soon as I topped the hill where I could see our house, I mean, it's like I just knew something was wrong. It was so bizarre, so bizarre. And it was only about a mile up the road. But by the time I got there, there were emergency vehicles there. There was a lot of people stopped on the highway. He said, he said, oh God, mom, I broke my back. They're like, can you wiggle your toes? I'm like, yeah. And then they're like, okay, do it. And I'm like, I am, I, I am. And nothing's moving, dude. I'm like, oh, that's, that's not good. <laughs> that's not good. I remember before surgery, I mean, like, from the, from the minute we got to the hospital and people knew what was going on, everybody that talked to us just said, you guys are so fortunate that Dr. Eric Howell is on call. You guys are so blessed that he's here. And then I think I got up and walked the next day. Mm -hmm. I walked from like my bed to the chair in the same room and sat in that chair. And then like the next day I got up and like walked to the nurse's station and back. And then I got up and like walked around the love that love that story. And then I'd like walk outside. I'm telling you, I have never met somebody that was so cool confident, just confident in his abilities. You know, his demeanor and his way of explaining things. We did, we, you know, we were all just like, okay, this is gonna be what it is. If it can be a good outcome, he's gonna do it for us. And we were, we were really, really blessed. I mean, I guess the, the, the thing that speaks to me the most about Dr. Eric Howe is that he is quietly confident and we already knew he was confident because of everybody that we had been in touch with that day everybody that we came into contact with so I'm thankful to God and I'm thankful to Dr. Eric Howe for what they did everything that he did along the way <laughs>